we have a bachelor of planning and a master of urban management and planning. And so when students start the bachelor, they generally continue on to do the master of urban management and planning. So students will essentially graduate with two degrees in four years, where at other universities it would generally take five. So it's quite efficient from a time perspective. And both degrees um, are accredited by the Planning Institute of Australia. Um, which makes seeking employment after um, a little bit easier. In the bachelor years, the three years where the students are doing the bachelor of planning, students will do core social sciences units that all students in social sciences do. Then they'll do some required geography and urban studies major units, and then they'll also do some required planning units. And there's about four electives in there as well that students can choose from across the university. In the master year, there is a unit called the Urban Planning Placement Project and students are placed within either a local council or a non-governmental organization or a private planning consultancy firm and they complete at least six full days of work at this workplace. Most students that do the bachelor pathway to the Master of Urban Management and Planning become planners. So they become planners in a local council, for instance, either within strategic planning or development assessment planning, or they can work for a planning consultancy firm, which is a private firm that provides advice to, for instance, developers that are preparing a development application, or they can also work for non-governmental organizations. So planning is quite a diverse um, occupation and there's a lot of opportunities in planning for students. We have um, a really broad range of expertise, our staff. Um, we have staff who have expertise in the legal frameworks of planning, we have staff who have expertise in more of the social and economic types of planning, and then we also have staff in them who have expertise in, for instance, urban design as well. So we come to um, teaching the units with a broad range of expertise and, and uh, diverse backgrounds. So students will be doing a degree in Western Sydney that's very relevant to Western Sydney. It's relevant to the growth processes in, in metropolitan Sydney and it provides them with key contacts in local organizations and councils in Sydney. So I think in that way we add a lot of value to the student experience.